Welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Pearl, the one that's on quite late after the game was fucking released about five years ago. Anyway, I'm sorry for the recording method because for whatever reason, I'm guessing it's because I'm shooting this during the daytime and it's quite bright outside that you're going to see my reflection as well as the reflection of the camera in the screen of the DS, so I'm going to apologize beforehand for that. Anyway, let's get started, sorry. This is my room. Not much going on here, so may as well head back do head on downstairs to see what's going on. Oh, hey mom, what's going on? Storm. Barry came calling for you a little while ago. I don't know, what is it? Ugh, God. How did I mess that up so badly? <laughs> I don't know what it was about, but he said it was an emergency. Okay. Let's see. It's on TV. Here we are. It's the Contest Digest. The winner of today's normal rank smart contest is... Wesley, who won with his bright spark of a Pokemon. You're not going to tell me what Pokemon he, w he used, are you? That's all the time we have today. Let's meet again. Alright, time to go find our friend. Huh? Oh yes, Storm! Don't go into the tall grass. Wild Pokemon might attack you. It would be okay if you had your own Pokemon, but you don't. So... Fuck that shit. Ah, damn. Sorry about all the brightness as well. My webcam isn't quite the best for recording. Uh, oh, f oh, you stupid son of a bitch, Barry. Fucking running out, in and out and everywhere. Stop doing it. What was that about? Oh, hey, Storm. Hey, I'm going to the lake. You come too. And be quick about it. Okay, Storm. I'm finding you one million... Yen? Is it yen or... Do they call it dollars in this game? I don't think they've actually said... Yeah, I'm finding you one million yen, I'm just gonna say that. If you're late. Oh, jeez. Forgot something. Hello there, not mother. Oh, hi Storm. Are you looking for Barry? He was gone for a second, but he came running right back home. He just can't sit still, that boy. I wonder who he takes after. Well, considering his dad is never around... Uh, he probably takes after him, maybe? I'd better take my bag and my journal, too. Oh, hey Storm. We're going to the lake. I'll be waiting on the road. It's a 10 million yen fine if you're late. Let's see what we can rob from his room. It's on his PC. You dumb son of a bitch, Barry. How could you not know this already? I guess I should introduce myself while we're in a bit of a lull at the moment, but my name is Storm Wrench. As you probably know already, I am an avid Pokemon gamer for the last, well, ever since Red Blue, they first came out, I've had them, and they were awesome, and I've been playing all the major games since, like uh, Gold, Silver, Crystal, Ruby Sapphire, Emerald, all that kind of stuff. Uh, the only Pokemon games from these kind of ones that I haven't played would have been Soul Silver. Black and fire red, so I haven't missed too much. But uh, anyway, let's continue here because Barry, the ignorant little bastard, has interrupted me. <sighs> hey, you saw that news report that was on TV, right? You know, search for the red Gyarados, the mysterious appearance of the furious Pokemon, and the like. That show got me to thinking. I'll bet our local lake has a Pokemon like that in, t in it too. So that's what we're gonna do. We'll go find a Pokemon like that. 
By the way, if you're wondering exactly why I seem to be knowing of these kind of lines so easily, it's because this is a re-recording, which is annoying, because uh, YouTube prevented my video, because I had about 16 minutes long, and uh, YouTube blocked it after it had been done processing. It was about 16 minutes long, till, and then it tells me once it was processed, which took about three hours, I think. It decided to tell me, oh, video is too long, we can't put it up there. And it was like, fuck you, YouTube, you piece of cunty shit arseholes. <sighs> it's annoying. Anyway, let's go on up here. Alright, to the lake. Let's find us a red Gyarados. What the fuck? Huh. Webcam was glitching there for a second. Huh? What's going on? Professor, there isn't anything out of the ordinary on the other side. Either. Hmm. I may have been mistaken. Something appears to be different than it was before, but... Fine. It's enough that we have seen the like. Dawn, we're leaving. Professor, how are you enjoying being back in Sinnoh? After being away for four years, it must be exciting again. Hmm. There is one thing I can say. There are many rare kinds of Pokemon in Sinnoh. The region should serve us very well in regard to our studies. Also, uh, I will apologize a bit for all the swearing I do, but it's just too natural for me to really care. So, if you don't like swearing, you don't have to watch the video, but uh, if you don't mind it too much, I'll try to not do it too often, but I can't make any promises. This game can evoke some feelings out of me in terms of, well, especially in reading some of the texts and forgetting letters while I'm reading the words. Yeah. Anyway, let's continue. Excuse me. Let us pass, please. I beg your pardon. We'll be on our way. What was that about? Those two. Huh? Storm, let's go check this out. What's that up? Don't go into the tall grass? No problem. No problem. We won't be in there long enough for a wild Pokemon to come out. I originally remember going through this whole thing with um, him having Doug's voice from up, and it made it much, much funnier to me. And I decided I just couldn't be arsed doing it again, because yeah, it would have been just forced. Look, these are Pokeballs. It's about using these. Which one do you want, then? Well, oh, the Pokemon we have here, it's Turtwig, which is grass type, which of course evolves into Torterra, which is part ground, which is a good choice. Then we have Chimchar, who evolves into a fire fighting, which is kind of boring at this stage, you know, that they have three of them. And Piplup, who evolves into Empoleon, who has water steel. And for the purposes of this playthrough, I am going to pick Turtwig. But, can we survive this battle against a level 2 Sterly with our best friend Turtwig? Find out next time on, well, the next part of our playthrough. So, I hope you enjoy and come back for episode 3. I'll see you then.